Hey guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. In my previous video, I've really taught you guys how to um, kickstart the nitrogen cycle and what is the nitrogen cycle. In that video, I also mentioned few ways to kickstart your nitrogen cycle. And one of my favorite methods that I mentioned is to make your own solution or to DIY your own solution of ammonia chloride instead of buying. So basically, ammonia chloride is just a solution made by the ammonium chloride powder that is widely available is a non-restricted uh, goods that you can get anywhere in, even in some hardware stores or pharmacies pharmacy so um, uh, why why I choose this ammonium chloride solution is because you can control the amount of um, the value or the amount of uh, ammonia that is in the tank during the cycle because when the ammonia levels in your tank reach above 5 ppm it will delay or stall your nitrogen cycle so we don't want to do that so usually we dose till 1 or 2 ppm and let it be until your bacteria establish in your tank so let's get on to the equipments needed to make this ammonium chloride solution okay guys here is what we need to mix this ammonium chloride solution so we need a kitchen scale first basically this kitchen scale need to be uh, measured until a few grams we're going to use a very small amount here because i'll be using very small amount of uh, water volume i'm only using 100 ml of water so you can use any source of water um, but make sure it's clean so uh, 100 ml of water with a lid um, shrinch 3 to 5 ml doesn't matter and some markers to label your water container and of course the most important thing is uh, pp uh, gloves if you have uh, glasses you can use that as well but I first when I mix the solution I did not even use glove but better be safe than sorry we we should use glove and of course the ammonia chloride uh, powder uh, 90, 90 to 99% uh, pure ammonia chloride powder so here I will link the in the description below you guys can check it out but buy is very very cheap so I got 200 grams here but actually you only need maybe 50 grams will will do okay so let's get on with the experiment now okay guys let's go ahead and uh, mix the ammonia chloride solution so first we put in the measuring cup on the kitchen scale and we balance out the we make sure the scale is showing zero okay just to make sure so next we're gonna wear our gloves of course gloves so next, we'll be taking the ammonia chloride powder. We just need to put in 3 grams of ammonia chloride in the measuring cup. So 3 grams. So, done three. Make sure you close this properly and keep it one side. So we're done with the three. So next, okay. We move the scale on side. We take a hundred ml of clean water, and we just put the ammonia chloride inside. Don't worry, nothing. Be afraid. There is no weird. Uh, reactions so we just take the spoon and we mix until it's clear well that's keep the spoon on side so that's about it we are done with our ammonia class solution. So now we will talk about uh, how much do we need to dose according to the liters or gallon in your, of water volume in your tank. Okay guys, once we are done with the solution, we must make sure to label it. So this is NH4Cl. 
okay and next is um, okay once you label it so now I'm going to talk about how much you, you should dose for per liter of water so the equation is uh, 0 0.1 ml per one liter of water so let like this you will remember will give you one ppm so if you follow the my solution um, meaning that the you put in three grams roughly three grams three or four grams doesn't matter into 100 ml of uh, water you will get once you dose this uh, solution 0.1 ml per liter of water you get one ppm so i made a higher concentration so easier for a bigger tank to use less uh, dosage so what we're going to do here now i'll be dosing this five liter bucket of water and testing it later so i'm going to do it for for 1 ppm so this is 5 liter so i need roughly 0 0.1 ml for uh, 1 liter so it's 5 liter so i'll put 0 0.5 ml so my shrink Zero point five. Done. Zero point five. Okay. So just dust it inside. No worries. Done. Keep it, keep it one side. And then let it stand for around 15 minutes and then you can try to check. So if it's enough, you can um, leave it and let the cycle run. Or if it's not enough, you can also top up. Let's see on the ammonia test that I did on the 5 liter bucket, which we dosed our 0.5 ml solution to make it to 1 ppm. So this is the results I got on my uh from my api test kit so basically it's between 1 1.5 around there so it's pretty accurate our our solution uh, our ammonia collide solution so always remember that this is to peak your your ammonia in your tank usually we dose until 2 ppm one or two is pretty safe anything above five actually will stall your uh, nitrogen cycle so I hope you guys uh, learned something one or two. Maybe you can save a few bucks because this uh, money cryo powder is super cheap. Uh, and I know the pre-made solutions is uh, slightly more expensive, but I hope this helped you. So anything, uh, please let me know. Uh, how can I help you? Or if you need any explanation on the calculation or anything, how I got it, uh, derived and got this uh, solution, let me know. And I uh, hope this helped. Thank you very much. Hi guys, I hope the instructions were clear and the step-by-step -step method is clear um, to create this ammonia chloride solution. And remember, this ammonia chloride solution is to kickstart a fishless uh, nitrogen cycle only. And also, make sure to store it in a safe place where children cannot reach it or any other people cannot reach it. And make sure you label it properly. It's very important to label it um, ammonia chloride and dangerous or whatever it is and whatever not and of course the powder that you balance you have please store it properly as well where nobody can simply get it and um, if the instructions are unclear please uh, check out my website as I stated in the uh, description section and it will be step by step uh, instructions and also the formula, formula and how I derive the uh, solution so all the rest thank you very much keep, stay safe and keep it simple Thank you.